Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe says he wants to put a revised constitution into force in 2020. For more on this and other news in East Asia, we turn to our Noah Adam. So, Adam, this is the first time that Abe has laid out a clear timetable for the revision of, of the country's pacifist constitution. Can you just run us through the details of this proposal? Yes, Mark, the Japanese Prime Minister said acknowledging the existence of the country's self-defence forces should be done now to finally end all doubt about its legality. The remarks were made in a video message delivered at a celebration of the Charter's 70th anniversary on Wednesday. A possible revision to Article 9 remains a divisive topic among the Japanese public. It calls for the complete renunciation of war and cements Japan's post-war identity. Abe's wish to amend it has been criticized by some Japanese people and also neighboring South Korea and China as a revision could allow Japan to engage in war. However, Abe has previously said he wants to maintain the philosophy of pacifism and only change Article 9 to mention the SDF's existence. His proposals were met with protests from Japan's major opposition parties who said that Abe is threatening the fundamental principles of the country's constitution.